So these are, are powerful accounts of Christ on the cross. Um, getting here, of course, was a long journey. The last week of his life had many events, but it really culminates here. Everything's pointing towards, as, as prophecy had pointed towards, that he would be lifted up upon the cross. And so we see for our salvation, his willingness to submit to, to death um, for our sake. And so these chapters really have a powerful account of, of his suffering and death and his love for us. I'm excited to study these chapters together because I realized there was a huge part of the Savior's atonement that honestly I was kind of gliding by. I, I used to just focus mostly on Gethsemane and then jump ahead to the resurrection. But Jesus Christ is utterly abandoned on the cross and he feels that and he expresses that. And so as we understand more fully what happened to Christ on the cross, I think we can feel a greater sense of kinship with him in our own deep suffering.